This video was sponsored by CYANS.com. Check out the video description to learn more. The Yi 4K Plus action camera has traveled with me a lot. It helped me capture stunning views of Iceland, Barcelona, shores of the Baltic Sea and I've used it in a lot of my YouTube videos. In my opinion, it's still the best action camera for the price even in 2019 and it costs about 200 bucks. Let's take a look. The Yi 4K Plus has a very similar design to the original Yi 4K camera that I've been using for 3 years now and it still works as new. Make sure to check out the review of it and you'll find all the links down below the video. The Yi 4K Plus is compact, lightweight, well made and it packs a ton of technology in such a small body. A 12 megapixel Sony sensor can shoot videos up to 4K at 60 frames per second which is the key feature to me. I use 4K 60fps not only for smooth footage but also when I want to slow down the video in post for that cinematic look. I also like a touchscreen display that is extremely sharp. In addition, it looks great indoors and it's easily viewable outdoors and touchscreen responsiveness is great. We also have the USB Type-C port for charging which is really convenient. There is also a replaceable battery and a quarter inch thread on the bottom. The camera does not ship with any accessories which is a downside. I did get a bundle with a waterproof case which is usually just 30 bucks more expensive. The user interface is also one of my favorite features of this little camera. It's really simple, intuitive, there are plenty of settings to play with and most importantly it's fast. I like that I can quickly change the settings I need, switch from photo to video modes with a single swipe, preview videos that I shot, turn on or turn off the grid lines and so on. Additionally, Yi technology really cares about the products they produce. If you buy this camera, expect frequent software updates that constantly improve image quality and add new features. This is one of the reasons why I trust this brand and I've been using their products for years now. I found the Yi Action Camera app to be intuitive and responsive. While it's not overloaded with features, you can adjust your camera settings, switch from different shooting modes, preview the videos or download them to your phone. Now the most important part, the image quality. First of all, this camera can shoot videos in a variety of different resolutions and frame rates. I will leave a link down below the video for a complete list of specifications. The resolutions I use the most include 4K at 60 and 30 FPS, 2.7K at 30 FPS when I wanted a bit smaller file sizes. So let's talk about that image stabilization Yi is bragging about. You can get really beautiful handheld shots in 4K at 30 FPS. The video is really stable while panning or tilting the camera and even while you're walking. Also, the footage is really sharp, there is plenty of detail and the colors are pretty accurate. Really love the overall quality. If you put the camera on a gimbal in this video mode, I recommend you turning the electronic image stabilization off. Otherwise, you'll get a lot of jello effect which personally makes me a little bit sick. If you want to get beautiful 4K at 60fps video, you definitely need to use a gimbal as there is no image stabilization in this video mode. I use the Feiyuta gimbal that I've reviewed on my channel before and I can highly recommend it. The video has plenty of detail, sharpness and it's really smooth thanks to 60fps. Also, you can simply slow the footage down to 30fps and get nice cinematic shots. Handheld 60fps video is quite shaky. Well, it's possible to get usable shots but I would not use them in my videos. That's why I use the gimbal. There is also the so-called 4K HD video mode that basically allows you to shoot in higher than standard 4K video resolution. The footage looks really nice but keep in mind that it is narrower than usual meaning that you will get black bars on the size of the video if you watch it on a standard monitor. 2.7K at 30 frames per second supports electronic image stabilization and the video looks pretty good even if shot handheld. However, I mostly shot in 4K at 30 frames per second as the image stabilization is the same but there is more detail in the footage. 
You need to know that there is visible lens distortion effect in each video resolution, but it can be either corrected with a camera at the expense of the field of view or corrected in post using video editing software. I shot all the videos with the lens distortion feature off as this was a standard setting on the camera. The area where the E 4K Plus camera collapses, low light. I simply cannot recommend you using this camera at night as there is plenty of noise in the video but this is the case with all action cameras, simply due to the small sensor size. On the other hand, still image quality is really good for an action camera. If you take pictures in good lighting, the results will usually be really good. Well, the dynamic range could be better but overall, I'm happy with the image quality. I could get about one and a half hours of continuous use out of this camera as I shot mostly in 4K at 60 or 30 FPS modes. If you tend to record videos in lower resolutions, you can expect up to two hours of battery life, which is one of the best results in the industry. Overall, I really love my Yi 4K Plus action camera and the reason why I bought it and keep using it almost every single day, I think it's still the best device for the price of about 200 bucks. The only thing that I don't like, poor low light performance but this is what you have to expect from each action camera. What I love about the Yi 4K Plus, the design, build, really sharp display, great user interface, smooth integration with the phone, good battery life and last but not least, great image quality which cannot be beaten at this price point. At the end of the day, I can highly recommend the Yi 4K Plus as my personal choice for a great action camera that is just packed with features. As always, if you are interested in picking one up, you'll find a product link down below the video. Now the word from the sponsor of this video, Seans. Seans.com sells everything you may want or need for comfortable and smart traveling. You can choose from gadgets, travel essentials, organizers, adapters, backpacks, journals and much much more. What I've got? A few pillows that are a must for anyone who wants to travel comfortably and enjoy the trip. The inflatable pillow is just awesome since it takes almost no space when deflated and it can be packed in a nice travel pouch it comes with. My absolute favorite however is the hoodie travel neck pillow, as the name implies it has a hoodie so it can relax even more during the trip. I also like this pillow because it's soft and smooth to the touch, you can adjust the hoodie to cover your eyes or the entire face or put it inside the pillow if you don't want to use it. If you want to get these pillows and a lot more other travel essentials, visit CENs.com. Again, check out CENs.com and you'll find all the links and show notes down below the video. What do you think about the Yi 4K Plus action camera? Would you buy this camera or would you choose another option? As always, like the video if you liked it, please subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, follow me on social media and as always, it was Linus, thank you for watching and see you soon.